All right, welcome back to Self Principle. As always, I'm Dr. Sean Hashmi. Now, today's question is dealing with the age-old battle of high carbs, low carbs, but there's a twist. So here's the question. The real question today is, is what is the most important thing when it comes to eating carbs? Is it the quantity of carbs, meaning how much carbs you're taking in? Is it the quality of carbs, meaning how good they are, whole grains, refined grains, all of that stuff? Or is it the timing of carbs, meaning if you have carbs earlier in the day or later in the evening, does any of that matter? And if so, which one is the most important thing going on? Well, to answer that question, we have a new study it was published in Diabetes Care 2022. And in this one, it's a secondary analysis and they were using the National Health and Nutrition Examination Survey along with the National Death Index data for adults going on. So in essence, they were looking at about 27,600 people going on. And all of the participants, they were divided into one of four groups. So it was either high quality or low quality carbs going on. And then they were factoring that with the amount of carbs, low carb versus high carb. So you get essentially a four um, subgroup design going on. All right, so let's dive into the results. What did these guys find? Well, the first one is easy. When they looked at the group that was getting low quality carbs, that's your refined grains, refined breads, your, um, you know, um, French fries and all of those things that we know are really not that good for you. Pizzas, pastas, donuts, all of those things. So daily intake of low quality carbohydrates was related to about a 13% higher risk of all cause mortality. Sounds straightforward. On the flip side, high quality carbohydrates throughout the day had a 12% lower risk of all cause mortality risk. So straightforward, quality matters. Higher quality, lower risk of death. Lower quality, higher risk of death. Now let's make a little twist. And the twist is let's talk a little bit about timing. So participants who consumed more high quality carbohydrates at dinner time specifically, they had about a 30% reduced risk of cardiovascular mortality and an 18% reduced risk of all cause mortality. So especially when it comes to dinner time, the quality of your carbs matters even more going on. Then let's say you are somebody who's having some really bad food at dinner time. What if you just substituted one serving of low quality carbs, replaced it with one serving of high quality carbs at dinner time? You actually reduce the cardiovascular risk by 25% and all cause mortality by 19% simply by changing one serving. And if you were a diabetic, the risk reward ratio is actually even more startling. So there was a 78% greater diabetes mortality among participants who consumed more low quality carbs at dinner time. Now, what was interesting about these participants was they were actually getting more high quality carbs throughout the day. But just the fact that at dinner time, they were eating bad carbs actually contributed more to their overall mortality than anything else going on. So put, taking all of this information, putting it together, what's the bottom line that you want to apply to your life right now? Here it is. What you want to understand is, is that the quality of carbohydrates matters and the timing matters even more. So in other words, putting it together, you want to eat high quality carbohydrates at dinner time. Remember, most people do the opposite. They get off work, they're tired, they want to go to a fast food and get the food. But turns out dinner time is the worst time you can actually have junk food. So I hope that helped you guys out. If you guys have any questions, any comments, I would love to hear your feedback. If there's a topic you're interested in, drop it in the comments below. Let me know what you'd like to hear and I'll be sure to cover it next time. Thank you.